Let's talk about back testing and why you should be back testing before doing any trading. I'm going to show you just kind of my findings and how just I would say in about five, six hours of doing this, I could potentially double my profitability actually become twice as profitable with this strategy by simply adjusting the risk to reward. So you can see here, this is like what it looks like on my platform. I use thinkorswim. You can see on demand. If you click on the on demand feature, it allows you to go back in time. Let's say we want to go back in time to May 17th at 9:43. You can just hit go. And this is what I was doing. I was just going through and buying the contracts. Obviously, I'm looking at my trade data. I'm looking at my trade log. Historically, just putting on those same trades that I've already taken. But what I'm doing is I'm adjusting the risk to reward. Now, I made a whole video on actually how to use this feature. I'll put it in the link in the description if you use TOS and you want to set this up. But what I was doing was I was trading this one to two, negative 10, positive 20, which is the risk to reward. And based off of that, I was essentially placing the trade. And then I was playing the trade through and I'm able to sit here after I put on the trade and essentially see what would have happened, okay, based off of that adjusted risk to reward. So I had been trading a one to 0.67, okay, where my take profit was set at 20% and my stop loss was set at negative 30%. And now I'm going back through and I'm back testing a one to two where my stop loss is set at 10% and my take profit is set at positive 20%. So limit is take profit, stop is stop loss. And then you can see here my p and I'm gonna let this play out and then either my stop loss or take profit will get hit. I'll go ahead, log that, throw that in my trade journal. And I'm doing this, okay, over and over and over as I progress through the last couple months worth of data. And I'm gonna show you my findings. So what I just went about doing was I went through a month segmented out worth of trades. And instead of trading this one to 0.67 R, instead I traded that one to two R, okay? Where I'm risking 10% to make 20%. And you could see here the results. This was just buying one option contract. Now trading like this, I do trade consistent position size, but that's not what I was trying to do here. I wasn't trying to necessarily actually make money. Well, I was more trying to figure out what my win rate would be because based off of that win rate, you can see here with a 70% win rate trading a one to two risk to reward, my break even win rate is 33.33%, which means I have a positive 11% expected return. Like I said, I'm using back testing to squeeze more profit out of my current trading system. Before I was trading that one to 0.67 R and my win rate was 75%, which in that case, my break even win rate would be 60% and my expected return was 7.50%. So again, if I had gone back and instead of trading this risk to reward, I traded a one to two, I would have gone from a 7.50 to an 11% positive expected return. That is not quite double. If you look at the last two months, this was just a month segmented worth of data. I'm actually doubling my expected return. The first variable is going to be risk to reward. And within risk to reward, what is the actual SL and TP in percentage? And because this is a fast, high paced day trading strategy, before I wanted to give these trades a little space to kind of play out. But it turns out that taking that stop loss from 30% to 10%, well, I was just cutting those what were eventually or essentially going to be losers. They were all going to draw down to 30%. I just cut them earlier and only about two of the 45 trades that I've taken over the last about two months. Well, only two of those that were winners actually ended up getting stopped out at negative 10%. So my win rate is virtually the same, but now I'm that much more profitable thanks to the power of back testing. And now I'm super excited to hop back in the market, trade with the team over inside my mentorship group, making sure that obviously I'm not the only one having success. I post all of my personal trades. So uh, everyone over in my discord is essentially able to follow along and copy myself if they so desire. So I'm going to go tell the team right now that we're about to become a whole lot more profitable. Now, if you'd like to learn how to trade yourself or have access to see my exact trades, I'll put the first link in the description below. 
where you can learn more. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one.